away we go. Going on close to 30 years. I inspect everything on the way up every morning. Oh yeah. And she wiggles around pretty good. I know that the machine is in good working order, so there's really nothing to be afraid of. Well, you really can't be afraid of heights if you want to work up there. Just know that you're safe. There is railings in there that you can't see from outside. Safety railings, great on the bottom, so your feet are on metal. You don't actually stand on the window. And I'll also take that single on this small one. That's the only time I'm ever afraid of heights, is standing on glass. I've done it twice in my life, and I don't like it. We started this job in January, and we'll be done about a month, so pretty much a year. Most of the time you're pretty busy. There are a few days that, you know, things don't go right on the ground and you wait for a while. I turn on my radio and listen to the local radio station until they start hollering again, and you just kind of go back to your zone and go as fast as you can. There's no way to get off except for the bottom. you got to come all the way to the ground if you want to go do something else. i got a jug I carry up and down. I've trained myself over the years to not use the other. I do that morning and night. You know, it's during the day, you just don't. I love my job. I've got to run some of the neatest equipment in the world. I run 1,000 ton cranes and tower cranes are really fun. We're only 155 feet to the bottom of the jib on this one. You know, six years ago when the hospital was done, our low crane was 160 and our high one was 218. So a lot more ladder rungs to get to the top one. <laughs> The crane is actually stressed to its just about its limit backwards when there's nothing on the hook. So they load it pretty heavy. That counterbalance, it's just a steel band with concrete poured inside of it. The big ones are 58, so, you know, two and a half ton. And then the little ones are just about 2,000. It would take a really large crane on the ground to pick what one of these will pick out at radius. This is a pretty small crane, and it can still pick almost 8,000 pounds out at the end at 150 feet away. Hold that a sub, buddy. You gotta be very careful. It's a very dangerous business to be in. When I first got into construction, I was on a job where my man lost his life. I guess I've spent the rest of my life not wanting to see that ever again. You really be careful. You do your due diligence on your inspections, make sure everything's right every day. Because that's what it's all about, is everybody going home. Personally, in the 30 years I've been in the crane, I have never had a timeless injury because of me. So that's a pretty important thing, you know, you go home at night going, well, you, you made it through another one, you didn't hurt anybody and everybody's got a smile on their face when they go to their car.